I get so caught up in the middle Thinking of drowning in those blue eyes I'm losing sight cause I am falling I'm so deep down, deep down And it's not a lie that I die Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I am tackling my entire house. Um, it has been a while since I have posted a whole house clean with me, mainly because of my health. And typically I cannot handle cleaning the entire house on one day. However, on this day, um, most of the house was already picked up. So it really was just kind of scrubbing surfaces, cleaning the bathrooms and stuff like that. So thankfully my health cooperated with me and I was able to get everything done that I needed to get done. So for those of you who are new here, my name is Danielle and I bring cleaning motivation videos. However, I will let you know that as I mentioned, I have some health issues that sometimes kind of get in the way of cleaning. So my videos may look a little different from some of the others that you watch because I simply am not capable of doing everything that some of the other women do on these channels. But if you are interested in these types of videos, I would love it if you would click on that subscribe button and also click on that bell so that you get notified whenever I post new videos. Um, also find me on Instagram and give me a follow over there. So I'm starting this clean with me in the office by wiping down all of the surfaces and cleaning all of the, like the glass mirror kind of stuff. Um, on this day, I kind of took everything room by room. So I went into each room, wiped everything down, dusted, scrubbed anything, and then did the floors before moving on to the next room. So we are getting ready to leave to go to Louisiana. My two oldest children are visiting family members and they have been there for about two weeks. We are getting ready to drive. Um, it's about a 16 hour drive. So we'll be leaving early in the morning and driving all the way to Louisiana. Um, we will stay overnight one night on the trip and then we will be spending about two weeks in Louisiana visiting with family and then we will be making the drive back here so that we can get settled and have a little bit of time to recover before I have to go back to work and the kids go back to school. So my goal for today was to just get everything straightened up in the house. I want to be able to leave the house being 100% clean. So when I come back, I'm not just overwhelmed with a bunch of chores that need to be done. All right, moving into the playroom, there was not a whole lot for me to do in here. I wasn't going to like scrub the bookshelf or anything like that because I just wasn't in the mood to take all those toys down and all that. So I just kind of wiped what I could, cleaned the TV, and then I am going to pull in the vacuum and get the floor in here cleaned.
now I'm moving into what I call the entryway, even though it is not the entryway. Um, it's just easier for us to say, hey, the entryway table. So I'm just gonna wipe this down and clean the mirror. This spot right here, um, especially the mirror, they just kind of get covered in little fingerprints and stuff because the kids are always walking by and messing with stuff on the table, moving my decorations. Caden is constantly redecorating this area and I am always having to pick those little beads up off the floor or take them away from him and put them back. So there was you know, quite a bit of gunky little fingerprints all over this area. So if you've watched any of my previous videos, you might realize that the dog's kennel is missing. Um, she has gone to my dad's house so that she has somewhere to stay where she's going to be taken care of while we're gone because we cannot take her to Louisiana with us. Um, for one thing, she's an older dog and does not travel well. So she just kind of hangs out at my dad's house and gets spoiled whenever we go anywhere. Wide away. I am cleaning this little built-in bookcase behind our chairs. It had been quite some time since I had wiped down everything in this area, so I did try to make sure I moved things and dusted under everything. Um, and I'm just using the Method All-Purpose Cleaner for everything that I am wiping down on this day, um, except I'm using the Jaws Cleaner for like the mirrors and stuff like that. There's something about the way you move. So the next two areas are areas I don't really show all that often on my videos. Um, this is our little mudroom area right outside our garage door and our half bath. Um, these two areas, for one thing, the kids don't really mess with the mudroom area much other than to put their shoes there. So there's typically not a whole lot to do. I just wipe it down every once in a while. And then this bathroom, this is the bathroom that all of our guests use. So 
it gets cleaned frequently. So a lot of times when I'm filming these videos, that bathroom doesn't need to be cleaned because it is one of the, you know, one of the rooms we make sure gets cleaned multiple times throughout the week, just so that if somebody comes over, we know the bathroom's clean and it's not something we have to stress about. From Japan, would you stay awake? I'm losing touch of who I am when you're far away. And I feel like I'm running in circles around you. Mm. And I know I've been acting strange for a while. But I want you close. Right, so now I'm moving into the last two areas of the main floor, which is the dining area and the kitchen. Um, I had planned on mopping on this day, but then I decided against it because while I was inside doing all this cleaning, my husband was outside doing yard work and I knew as soon as he was done, he was going to come inside and there was going to be grass and dirt and everything all over the floors again. So I'm actually holding off cleaning, um, mopping the floors at least until right before we leave. So we're going to be leaving early Thursday morning and I will probably either mop or run the cross wave on Wednesday night. And that way the floors are as fresh as they can be when we're still going to have three cats running around the house while we're gone. So another note, um, if you watched my previous videos, you'll saw that our refrigerator broke and we are living out of a mini fridge right now. Our new refrigerator is going to be delivered the day before we leave. So when I filmed this video, we still just had the mini fridge and that's what the water bottles are there for. We normally don't keep bottled water in the house because we've always had a refrigerator that we could get filtered water out of. So when our refrigerator broke, I went out and bought water so that we could have good water to be drinking until we had another refrigerator available. When I shut my feelings out You look at me like I'm different Still you stay cause you feel something real Get so lost in my moments Doesn't mean I don't need you I, 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 I fell in love with your colors They kinda tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are and the way we lose it There's something different about us And the reason why we stay Stay We fly around like paper planes So I ended up taking a break after I cleaned downstairs. We had dinner and I just kind of relaxed for a little while to get my energy back up. And then after dinner, I went upstairs to tackle cleaning upstairs. Um, there wasn't as much to do upstairs. The bedrooms were clean. Like I said, my oldest two boys have not been here for two weeks. And then Caden hardly spends any time in his room. He's pretty much 
only in his room for sleeping. So the only thing I needed to do to each of the boys' bedrooms was just kind of wipe those surfaces down and vacuum their floors. Um, and while I'm upstairs, I'm using the Mrs. Myers all-purpose spray, um, just because that's one of the sprays that we had upstairs. I wasn't gonna tote up my other spray because I have some cleaning products downstairs and then some upstairs. Just makes it easier instead of having to go up and down the stairs, bringing stuff up and down all the time. Just to block out the real life, real life. All right, so now I am in the boys' bathroom. This is another room that you don't often see in my videos, mainly because my oldest son is responsible for keeping their bathroom clean. Um, so since he was gone, nobody's really been using this bathroom. I just wanted to come in, do some light cleaning. It wasn't really too bad. I just wiped down the counters, cleaned the toilet and the bathtub, just to get everything back in shape so that the boys also have clean spaces when they come home. We fly around like paper planes They never know where we will fall Nobody can see us Still they wanna tear us apart There's something different about the way we are Say something Still I try to connect with you Through your eyes Your eyes What is on your mind? I think it's time to speak I have crossed the line But no, not just me I'm feeling something That goes beyond us Can we work it out? Only time will tell It's gonna take a lot Cause we've been through hell I can't be without you I've tried and I failed So can we work it out? Yeah. Only time will tell I still want all of you And I know all your colors and I guess cause of that I can think of no others Yeah, I need you to be without you, I'm lost I'm lost, yo What is on your mind? I think it's time to speak I have crossed the line But no, not just me I'm feeling something that goes beyond us Right now I'm wiping down this little bookshelf that we have up here at the top of the stairs. Um, I don't know what it is about this shelf. I don't know if it's the material or what, but this little bookshelf just collects dust more than pretty much any other piece of furniture in our house. So I pretty much always find myself wiping it down. Um, and then as I mentioned in previous videos, everything that you see along this little half wall, this is just where I kind of stick stuff that needs to go downstairs. And at some point, whenever somebody's gonna go down the stairs, they'll grab a handful of them and put them up. All right, so now I'm moving into my oldest son's room. Um, another room you don't often see on my channel because it is his responsibility. But since he's not here, I just wanted to go in and wipe everything down like I did in his brother's rooms. Um, Cause I really wanted to make sure that, you know, I just feel like if my kids come home to clean bedrooms, then 
I think they'd appreciate that more than coming home to just something that's trash, like nobody gave any thought to them being gone. It's gonna take a lot, cause we've been through hell, I can't be... All right, so I decided to end the night in our bedroom. Um, I am going to straighten the bed, but I'm not going to make the bed because this was just like an hour or two before we went to bed. Um, so I'm just gonna straighten everything up, wipe everything down, and then move into our bathroom. So I will say it has been a lot easier to kind of keep things in check and in order in the house with two of our three kids not being here. Um, so as you can see, there wasn't a whole lot of stuff out of place in the house, just a handful of things here and there that needed to be picked up. So most of what I was doing on this day was just wiping all those surfaces down, um, which is kind of how I prefer to keep things. It's much easier for me if I can go in and clean and not have to do all that bending down and picking up and putting things away. So hopefully we can kind of keep my little system going when the kids come back and they can really pick up and help pick up some of that slack and keep their areas clean. All right, so that is it for this video. I'm just going to finish up by folding some laundry and getting it all put away. So I just wanna take the time to thank you for watching this video and I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure you give it a thumbs up and I hope you will come back and check out my future videos. So thanks again and have a good night. Bye. You're
friends have told me just to give you time 